Welcome to our channel, today we're going to explore failed aviation designs in history. The Rockwell XFV-12 was an experimental vertical takeoff and landing VTOL, finer aircraft developed by Rockwell International in the 1970s. It featured a unique tilt wing design that allowed it to take off and land vertically like a helicopter, but transitioned to horizontal flight like a traditional aircraft. Despite promising test results, the XFV-12 ultimately failed to progress beyond the prototype stage. One of the biggest challenges of the XFV-12 was its tilt wing design. The aircraft needed to be able to transition from vertical to horizontal flight seamlessly, which required a complex mechanism for tilting the wings. This mechanism was prone to failure and was difficult to maintain. In addition, the aircraft had a complex hydraulic system that was difficult to control and often leaked. The XFV-12 suffered from significant stability and control issues. Pilots found it difficult to control the aircraft during takeoff and landing which are the most critical phases of flight. He XFV-12 had a limited payload capacity, which made it less useful than other fighter aircraft. It was designed to carry only two missiles and a limited amount of fuel, which severely limited its range and combat capabilities. The U.S. military was already using other aircraft, such as the Harrier, which had similar VTOL capabilities but were already in service. This competition made it difficult for the XFV-12 to gain support from the military. The system was designed to be fully automatic, with the aircraft's onboard computer controlling the wing tilt angle and other flight parameters. However, the system was prone to malfunctions and required frequent maintenance, which made the aircraft expensive and difficult to operate. Despite these challenges, the XFV-12 demonstrated impressive performance capabilities during its test flights. The aircraft was capable of reaching speeds of up to Mach 1.1 in horizontal flight mode, and had a maximum altitude of 38,000 feet. It also had a range of over 1,000 miles and was capable of carrying a variety of weapons, including air-to-air -air missile. In the end, however, the XFV-12 failed to live up to its potential as a viable military aircraft. Its complex and expensive design, coupled with its handling issues and underpowered engine, made it impractical for production and deployment. Despite this, the XFV-12 remains a fascinating piece of aviation history and a testament to the innovative spirit of its designers and engineers.